You're listening to the Berkeley Internet Radio Network. Welcome back, everybody. Thanks for joining us again. You're tuned into The Burn, the Berkeley Internet Radio Network. You're listening to Channel Burn One. And we're joined here again by Amber Rubarth and another special guest, Jason Reeves. And they've decided to come up and uh, do a song together after they've already played a show. <laughs> we we love you for putting us, you know, in this situation. So we'll just sing for you again and again and again. <laughs> and Amber's my favorite human being on the planet. I'm not saying it because we're under the gun. She is. There's sincerity in your eyes. I see it. There's all s- true. It's true. It's all true. Anyway... Thanks for having us. Yeah, we're also, Chad Blinman is here. Yes, hi. Thanks for being here. Of course, this, thank you. This is great. How How is everybody feeling right now? Fantastic. Fantastic. I mean, Amber's blown us away with two of her songs, and now we're going to hear a duet. I mean... She's a mind boggler. Yeah, what? pretty much. <laughs> yeah, she is. I'm yeah. smiling too much to say anything <laughs> right now. <laughs> My favorite human on the whole planet just said that I was his favorite human on the planet. <laughs> now that's... That's special. <laughs> and we're getting the whole thing on video. Yeah. <laughs> That's special right there. That's double special. That's a wicked. Cool. So, you know, what's what's the deal? You want us to play that song right now? Yeah, go okay. for it. Yeah, let's do the song and then we'll have a little chit chat. Cool. Right. Yeah. Well, this song just got named on stage <laughs> and it can still change. The name can change if you don't like it. Oh, I love it. Okay, because I love yeah. it too. Well, we just named this song before we played it for the first time, and it's called The City Starts to Bloom. Here we go. Busy. 
busy streets go silent The city starts to bloom Whenever I'm alone with you It feels just like it's raining From a sky that's perfect blue When I'm alone with you Strangers in black and white with eyes on the ground Crashing into each other, lost in the crowd Braving the waves, all hoping they will be found On the streams of concrete, rushing out Whenever I'm alone with you Busy streets go silent City starts to bloom Whenever I'm alone with you it Feels just like it's raining From a sky that's perfect All the freckles on the sidewalks are just gum spots left like scars. Take our time to soak it all in as so many drive past in cars and they don't With you Busy streets go silent The city starts to bloom Whenever I'm alone With you Feels just like it's raining From a sky that's perfect blue This is Jason Reeves and Amber Rubarth here in the <laughs> Burn Live Room studio here with uh, Chad Blimmon and myself, Ro. Yes, technology to the rescue. <laughs> saved our lives right there. <laughs> that was a miracle. Okay, so, you know, sometimes you're in a situation that's abnormal, like being live on the radio, and both people involved forget how you start the song. And without being able to remember the first line, I couldn't remember any lines. You see the first line on, a, mm -hmm. on an iPhone, which is unbelievable in the first place. <laughs> and now the rest of the song is in your head. So, you know, magic. that was a magical, strange moment. And that iTunes, iTunes tuned that guitar as well. I, yeah. The iPhone. The iPhone the tuned the guitar, yeah. told us the words <laughs> when we lost our brains. <laughs> wow. Well, this, I mean, that's a real honest moment right there where technology came to the rescue. Go technology. Yeah, that was perfect. 
And it made like a cool one of a kind performance, very, actually. Very one of yeah, I'd like to see that, that one done again. The whole first <laughs> part of it was, was great. So you wrote that one actually together while you're touring? Mm hmm. Yeah. Which we were, is unusual, right? It's very, to write when you're very unusual. We were in the green room in Bo nope, Philadelphia. We're in Boston. We were in Philly and we were waiting for the show and it started to rain outside. And that's just where that song came from. It just came from the rain. And how did you thank two kind of get, yeah, thank you, rain. A lot of <laughs> yeah. good comes from the rain, right? Yeah. yeah. All these beautiful colors are here today. Rain and iPhones. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> right? iTuners. <laughs> um, how'd you guys get paired up and decide to do some shows together? I fell in love with Jason when he was <laughs> uh, playing at Room 5 in Los Angeles, a little place upstairs from a restaurant. Yeah. And I also fell in love with her there. That That's a very special room. It's very tiny. You can only get maybe 50 people at most if they're crammed in in that room. And so many songwriters in L.A. were playing there at the time. And I was brand new to L.A. And I was just getting my mind blown because I'm from Iowa and there was nothing like this happening at all. And, you know, Colby and I would come there and all of a sudden there's Amber Rubarth and all these incredible musicians. And I that's, you know, from then from then on, we've been playing together and. For some reason, we haven't really written music together until now, and that was the second time we've ever played that song. <laughs> wow. Hence the delay. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, I... There will be more. There will be more. We're going to do, We're gonna more do a whole album together someday. I, we just made it a, an official plan today. There's lots of things happening today. You yeah. name the song, you're yeah. planning it out. Yeah. Today's a yeah. special day. That's Boston for you. Yep. Totally. And uh, Jason, now you've been with Warner Brothers for a couple years now. Yes. How has that sort of changed how you do music and how you approach music and your journey? It's changed a lot. It's helped me a lot. It's been an amazing experience. I'm glad I'm with that label in particular as opposed to some of the other ones. No offense to them at all. I'm just very happy with where I'm at. And, I mean, it does change everything. I've, I have to be much more patient with with releasing music, at least. Because I write so many songs, it's kind of like an illness. I just, I, it's nothing I could ever keep up with, even if, you know, even if I were allowed to freely release songs as I choose, I wouldn't probably be able to keep up. But it's just about being more patient now. I have a whole team of people I have helping me, though, so there's good and bad with it, you know? Sure. And you have a, an album coming out, right, this summer? I do. I have a new record this summer called The Love Sick which I'm insanely excited about. It's It's been a while since I put out a full-length album, and, you know, it's just good to have new songs, to play them for other people to hear. Songs get old to me, and I want new ones. And it's kind of a new... I mean, to me, it sounds like a new sound or a, or a sound that's a different side of you with uh, Helium Hearts and mm -hmm. Sticks and Stones a lot. Yeah. It's... It's, it's a different record. It's... I... You know, I've been recording, and people don't even know the oldest ones, but I've been making albums with just my guitar for about eight years. And when I went into the studio this time, it kind of happened on accident at first, but um, once I realized that I could get outside of that and add crazy things I've never experimented with before, I, you know, I wanted to push myself outside of that because I'll always come back to it. It's not like I'm abandoning, you know, folk music or wherever whatever people say my music is. It's just, I am i don't want to be limited. I'm going to make a hip-hop record next after this one. I'm not even kidding at all. Um, I hope you do, actually. <laughs> I'm not one bit kidding. I'm going to make a hip-hop record. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to rap. And, um, you know, I just, I don't want to get stuck in one place. I want to push myself around, you know, the musical world and, and have fun. It's just like, that's what I want to do, you know. 